AFTV Shah. I saw smiles here, but that second half, there was a lot of nerves. We got the 1-0 win in the end. We grinded it out. Um, how are you feeling? Mate, Turkish, I am absolutely shocked at the way we performed, but I'm even more shocked that we managed to get the three points. Obviously, I am disappointed by that, but that was luck in that second half. Um, it was a complete different performance to what we've been seeing last week and prior weeks. Um, yeah, shocking, but, you know, we move. What do you, what do you think it comes down to, the level of performance today? Because, like you said, in the league, it probably is our poorest performance so far this season. We still walk away with the three points, but I think we're all in agreement. Our poorest performance. What do you think brought it on? Do you know what? I guess it's football. There's going to be moments where we're full of energy, we're full of character, we go out there and put out our best performances. And there's also going to be other times where we ain't playing at our best, you know, we're humans, it's natural. Um, however, today, I just feel like Leeds, like I said before the game as well, we don't underestimate any team. Yeah, they're sitting lower in the table, they're struggling with wins and everything, but we do not underestimate anyone, we don't take any team lightly. Um, and I think that proved today but Leeds they're a team that play with high intensity they're very quick they're very sharp and I just don't think we was able to quite deal with that pressure that they was bringing in the first half that's how they kicked off the game with that intensity we managed to find our feet get a rhythm going everything but second half we just couldn't really handle it yeah and that second half was was madness to say <laughs> the least painful. I don't even know which incident to really touch on but what I will ask you is, Ramsdale and Xhaka tend to be getting the plaudits coming out of the game. Two of the only players to be getting the plaudits. What did you make of their performance? Do you know, Ramsdale, brilliant, brilliant performance from him. He made some crucial saves, you know. Um, yeah, and another clean sheet as well, thank God. And Xhaka, you know, he's showing a lot of leadership skills. We have to give him so much credit. Normally, he would have been the first player on the pitch when there's any incidents coming and flaring up. Whereas now, you can see he's a completely different person and he's really taking leadership and leading the boys and I think that's fundamental we've been saying we need more leaders in the team Xhaka's stepping up and showing look I am a leader and he's doing fantastic at it and a quiet performance all around from Saka but he gets the goal and it was quite a goal as well it came out no. of nowhere on his weak <laughs> of foot and he just smashed it into the roof of the net exactly big up Saka our star boy listen <laughs> that's like my favourite phrase like he always makes us so proud a fantastic goal from him I think he started really well you know first half I think he had a good performance he was someone that I was thinking to be man of the match um, but yeah there's not really much more he could have done I guess when you sort of sum, sum it up around the whole team yeah not really much more he could have done is this a performance you dwell on or do you move on to next Sunday against Southampton away still confident still knowing we're top of the league do you know, it's definitely not a performance that we ignore. I think the team need to sit down, which I know they will, analyse the game, look at everything that happened, where they went wrong, you know, what we could have done better. However, we don't dwell on it at all. Next week is a brand new game, fresh start. We start and we go again. We know what we're capable of doing. Don't let one bad performance bring you down or drain your energy or anything. We know who we are. We're Arsenal. We know what we can do and we know what we're fighting for. Right now, we're st still top of the table you know so let's not underestimate that and in between now and then Man United play Tottenham obviously our game against City has been postponed so there's still some league action to come before that Southampton game so the three points was so important today heading into PSV change it up Absolutely vital to get them three points today let me say um, PSV yeah I'll say perhaps our First team players, let's try and rest as many as we can. You know, the is, is there an argument to say that off the back of that performance, they might need that game to pick up their level back to what we were previously seeing? Or would you just rest all of them again? I would rest them because my question is, has that performance, let's not forget they travelled, um, played the game as well as travelling back. So I will perhaps rest the players because we don't want to burn them out as well, you know. So yeah. I would rest the players that we don't need. And yeah, do a bit of rotation there. Thank you, Shah. Thank you. Shop for AFTV merch at shop.aftv.co.uk. Subscribe to us on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat, and Twitch. We've got content for every platform. So check it out.